сука, сразу надо было так. И снова на нашем канале легендарный Александр Шторм Шлеменко. Боец, ставший олицетворением агрессивного, ударного стиля ведения боя. На его счету более 30 нокаутов в профессиональном ММА. При этом стиль Шторма направлен на максимальную зрелищность. Это постоянное стремление к бескомпромиссному обмену ударами и коронные яркие приемы, такие как удары коленями в прыжке, удары ногами по всем уровням и коронные бэкфисты. За это его и любят миллионы фанатов по всему миру. Ведь в каждом своем поединке Александр старается дать людям то, зачем они и смотрят смешанные единоборства. И его присутствие в карте турнира обещает зрителям запоминающийся бой. Сегодня мы с вами посмотрим еще один поединок с участием Шлеменко. На этот раз это будет 10 октября 2008 года. Турнир под эгидой Элит Экси, который проходил в США. Соперником Александра стал местный боец Роберт Буба Макдэниел, который был большим специалистом по борьбе в партере, обладал рекордом из 12 побед при всего 4 поражениях и под стать шторму старался не доводить дело до решения судей. На тот момент в его послужном списке не было ни одного поединка, который прошел бы полную дистанцию. Так что битва ожидалась быть очень жаркой и зрелищной. Дорогие друзья, с тех пор, как мы перезапустили наш канал, на нем опубликованы сотни видео с крутыми и зрелищными боями как с турниров M1 Global, так и других организаций. И мы рады, что они пользуются у вас большой популярностью. Новые видео выходят несколько раз в неделю. И чтобы не пропустить очередной шедевр из мира единоборств, настоятельно просим вас подписаться на наш канал, если вы этого еще не сделали. Ведь согласно статистике, 9 из 10 зрителей смотрят нас, увы, без подписки. А если же уже подписаны, то обязательно прожимайте колокольчик, чтобы быть в курсе всех обновлений. Заранее благодарны всем нашим уважаемым зрителям и желаем вам приятного просмотра. Revisiting the Cold War mixed martial arts style Shlomenko into McDaniel's clinch and the bigger, lankier. McDaniel pins Shlomenko against the fence, drops a level looking for the double leg. Off the cage! Shlomenko the holding cage. onto the cage has to be very careful. That could result in a point deduction. Looking for the standing Kimura right now as McDaniel expending energy trying to will his way to the double leg takedown, Stephen. And he's almost got it. Shlomenko going down to one knee. But Shlomenko is already grounded. All McDaniel has to do is put his back to the floor like that. He told us that he was concerned about the fact that McDaniel was a tall, lanky southpaw so far, causing him some problems along the fence. Again, drops down. But against the fence, it's, it's very hard as Shlomenko just drops to the ground there. We're past the midway point of the full mount and Shlomenko gives up his back. This could be dangerous. Eating all kinds of shots. Can't see where McDaniel is throwing them from. Shlomenko is in trouble here. Yes, he is. Now he's belly up. This is going to be a problem. He's got to maintain arm control to make sure that arm doesn't get in front of his throat. McDaniel very calm and methodical now with the full mount delivering some good old fashioned ground and pound. Shlomenko again surrenders his back. Into the final minute of action, a round that has been dominated by Wichita Falls, Texas native Bubba the Menace McDaniel proving to be a menace for the Russian. He's got his chin down, but it's still a problem. Because if that chin goes up, even a fraction of an inch, that choke's going in. Bubba lets it go. Shlomenko pops out only to eat more punches underneath. Those uppercuts under the armpit. That's, you can't even see that coming. Shlomenko watched the classic Pride Heavyweight Championship fight between Fyodor Emelianenko and Mirko Krokop for inspiration as he now turns into McDaniel. He's going to have to summon up some of his fellow Russian fighting spirit. And now there's a spinning back elbow and well timed by McDaniel dropping down for the shot. Shlomenko sprawls and it is a round that belonged to Bubba McDaniel as the first five minutes comes to an end. And McDaniel's hurt right at the bell. Это 
Where, where's your head, Bubba? Oh, my body's uh, hurt. His body, they hit you in the, in the stomach. Yeah. Uh, yeah. uh, yeah. uh, your ribs, uh, they popped out. Are you good? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, I couldn't see if it was going or not. It's the end of the round. I never stopped it. Let me see. Is it, I, mean, I, I oh, can't see if it's a groin or not. It's not his groin. No. It's ribs. Your ribs, right? Yeah. His ribs are hurt, man. Uh, uh, one minute up. Do you feel like I gotta stop it. Referee is waving the fight off, and as we heard, a great job by the crew to get into the corner. The referee thought it was a great shot. They're asking him how his body feels. It seems like he took the knee to the ribs. It's going to be a TKO win for Alexander Slamenko, who was losing that round until that Hail Mary shot. That's a flying knee right, oh, right under the heart. That's a TKO. That was a beautiful flying knee. Upper ribs, right under the heart. Right on the left peck as he threw a, a left hook at the same time. No groin shot there. That was a clean strike. Beautiful flying knee. And he needed something huge like that because he was losing that round. A very conclusive way to end a fight. That's a really sensitive area right there. Just to the side of the sternum, and that penetrates like that, and, and it goes to the side. Oh. That's a lot of pain. Shot through the harsh Lomenko's to blame. He picks up a TKO victory here at the end of round one, winning his show XE debut in scintillating fashion.